Well, it's wonderful to be here at uh, BBC Television Centre. I've got somebody uh, overseeing what we're doing. The bouncers are pretty ruthless uh, in this place. Um, and the unboxing. Unboxing is what this, uh, this little featurette is called. Seen for the first time on vinyl. Look at that. Oh, splendidly heavy. Splendidly heavy. The Dalek Master Plan. The Dalek Master Plan, as I would call it, uh, in my Lancashire tone. So let's have a look what we have here. Um, there are two versions. Do you mind? Thank you. It's quite, quite harmless, I assure you, on this occasion. Now, one particular choice available within all of this, if I may demonstrate, as I remember my correct vinyl handling technique, you can choose either this, uh, this very vivid, very shocking orange shade, rather like a red giant, perhaps Betelgeuse, being eclipsed uh, by a terrestrial planet in front of it in this manner. Very much so, very interesting indeed. <laughs> this, uh, this orange uh, vibrancy representing the path of evil. Now this first one, interestingly for vinyl, there is no B side, only this A side. On the B side, just a void, just a vortex. But I don't know if you can make that out, just the a ghostly imprint of a Dalek you can just make out there. You can either follow that, or if you wish to follow the, uh, the moral path that the Doctor himself would follow, then how about that? Now, our TARDIS blue, a very, very vivid TARDIS blue, yes, but TARDIS blue nonetheless. I think I'll go with that one. Ah, oh, some sleeves and artwork. Yeah, there we are, there's the, uh, the cast list. Very pleasant way to see it, there we are. That gives you all the information you require, I assure you. So much better than just scrolling a screen. Actually handling the real vi vinyl. The tangibility is wonderful. The first record I ever bought, actually, or I had it bought for me, was the theme tune to Doctor Who. A little seven inch 45 played on an ultra a record player that belonged to my sister and brother. And it was bought for me when I was five from Sounds Good in Ormskirk, wonderful record shop. Sadly not there anymore. But let's see, I believe that we can... All of these sleeves here can be put together. You can see various Dalek images emerging here. And of course you could spread these all out over your uh, Axminster carpet and that we may try it in a minute or two. And it will form either a, a, a Dalek-based image or the alternative, a TARDIS-based image. You can turn them over and display whichever you, you see fit, good or evil. So there it is really, what magnificent tangibility. You can't beat that. And uh, doesn't it bring to mind just how proud the great William Hartnell would have been that the programme that he started off and where he was the first to play the lead, that great tradition that he started, William Hartnell would have been so, so proud and overjoyed, I am sure, at the sight of this. 56 years later, his era still being honoured, still so important. Hmm. Yes, one day, one day, I shall get back. Yes, one day. Here's the next 156 years. 156 million years. We could go on.